I am glad that there is going to be another stimulus payment. And I wish there would have been payments, you know, before the sickness, you know, before um, that for people that need money. You know, because there's a lot of people living on the streets, well, you know, it seems like to me. And a lot of people that get disabled on the jobs and get fired, get laid off, and some get to heal up. They got the luck of healing up their injuries, and others don't. They stay disabled for who knows how long, sometimes until, you know, end of their lives, you know. <laughs> and I'm glad um, that there is has been talk that, um, you know, people are supposed to be getting um, more than one payment of the stimulus payment, especially the ones that need it. Or, you know, everybody needs it. The businesses need it. They, some of them got closed down, stuff like that, because of the sickness. And, and my sympathy goes out to anyone that has uh, the coronavirus or has passed away to, you know, from the coronavirus, and I'm very sad uh, that it's happened to them. And I uh, hope anybody that might have the coronavirus, you know, your life, um, and hope you get through it, heal up, and everything, the sickness goes away. <laughs> Well, anyways, I've heard and read that the people are supposed to be getting the stimulus payment every month, you know, and stuff like that. What is quite a downer, you know, I don't know if it's going to be for sure and stuff like that, is that I hope they're fair about it. Because every time people on Social Security, on Genesis, or whatever, gets a dollar more, for example, they want it back. People don't even get to spend their ten or twelve dollars extra that they get, right? They get it, and uh, it's all gone. The rent, people raise the rent. How are they supposed to survive when they can't survive, anyways? So hopefully, if that does um, go on, you know, people get supposed to get more money, um, and even if they weren't, it was still the same, which is a bummer because there are a lot of poor people out there that need their money to stay alive and survive. Uh, so. Hopefully it is fair, and if people get, when they get their stimulus payment, hopefully people aren't just going to yank it from them. They're stuck back um, in the same place, because even without um, the sickness, there's a lot of deaths of the poor, of homeless, dying, cold, overheating down the streets, and stuff like that. People being laid off from work or fire, having injuries, and stuff like that, and it's just sad, and I just hope... Um, things go on better for people, better for the poor, better for the middle income, better for the rich, you know, everyone, you know. Well, anyways, I'm going to play a little bit more of a tune. <laughs> Well, anyways, it's not good to yank anything from anyone, especially the poor, people that don't even have a place to live, that aren't naturally to live out on the streets, you know, and survive in that cold, hot, burning weather, even if it's a nice day. And it's not nice for people to be kicked out of stores and stuff like that, and that aren't even doing anything wrong or anything, and they're asked to leave. I wonder why they are. It sounds suspicious to me. Well, like I say, if anybody's falling into bad luck, which I hope they're not, I hope your luck gets better and I hope people keep a good, calm mind and get things going okay in their lives without letting anybody bother them. Don't let them get to town if they're bothering you, kicking you out of the store. Um, not saying that... You can't have this, you can't do that, you know. Hopefully they wise up and leave the innocent alone, you know, or anybody alone. All right, well, hope you guys have a good evening.